Welcome to the Daily Insight for Friday, February 2nd. We have two cards for love, two cards for career and finance, and of course we'll follow up with a Romance Angel card. So the first card for love is the Two of Pentacles followed by the Lover's card. Okay. So what I'm hearing is there is a group of you where you're having a hard time making a choice and this particular choice is head over heart in this group do i pick this new person and start this brand new relationship or move forward in an upward motion a more permanent grounded relationship or do i go the other direction this is literally head over heart and it's a very difficult decision. You may be thinking about moving overseas, so you may actually be looking at um, changing a position within your company that is making you feel as though, you know, should I pick this person or should I take this opportunity and relocate? This is another state, and it's over the water, so it's another state, another country, but it's far away from where you live what you're feeling is it's too far away to keep a relationship with this person and the truth is if they're the right person for you you can still have a relationship with them no you can't see them every single day but you can communicate and you can have a beautiful relationship that can grow until one of the two of you are ready to relocate Maybe both of you actually will wind up relocating in a neutral place in the in the middle between the two of you. But this is a very difficult decision for you to make. Whatever choice you make has to be the right choice for you. Not for them, not for them, but for you. So you really need to stay in balance. And you know, this is all about being grounded and centered so that you can make the choice that is applicable for you. This is a choice you're making. So stay grounded, keep your focus on what resonates with you, all right? Maybe they can move with you. Um, maybe it is only a six month duration of time. The details will be different for all of you, but what I'm hearing is just stay grounded and make the choice that is the best choice for you, not for anyone else. Okay, and that's the only message they're giving me, so let's look at a card. The romance card is make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. So there is a group of you that feel this other person, whomever it is that you are choosing this could be your family this is romantic saying make the effort but this could also be family not just romantic when it comes to romance make the effort so if you believe this is the person of your dreams this is the person that you would like to move forward and have a life with make sure you're making the effort to communicate to them to really think about the decision fully before you make that choice. Now for career and finance, and I will look at love, of course, we have the King of Swords and the Justice card. Okay. This is all about you standing up for your truth, okay? Communicating in a clear manner with this person Some of you, it could involve legal situations where maybe you need to, maybe they are um, from a different country and they need to go through the process of becoming legal in order for the two of you to move forward together. So you're debating, do you go there? Do you stay here? It's gonna be different for all of you. But again, the message is still the same. You know, King of Swords is a person who does stand strong in their own belief system. They are very intelligent people, very, very intelligent. Um, 
use your creative sense within yourself to make this right decision. When you stay in balance, you'll keep the scales of karma in balance, okay? This is all about balance here and making choices that resonate within yourself. When it comes to career and finance, some of you, what I'm hearing is there's some legal issue going on in your work. Now, maybe this is the paperwork when you started. Um, it's going to be different for all of you, but there's some type of a legal situation in your work environment that you are trying to make a choice. Do I stay or do I go? Now, the good thing is, is you are being told the truth and that's good. That will help you make this decision. But again, it all comes back to the same as love. Make the decision that is right for you. Stay in balance, stay grounded, so you can really see the, the, the light on the other side of the forest, okay? So you can see further out and make a choice that really resonates with you. And when you do that, whichever choice you make to stay or go, will be the best choice for you. You will be happy about that decision. Yep. So I do hope this helps you and have a wonderful day. Much love.